Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's the Lone Wolf Trucker coming at you uh, once again with another video. Um, hopefully, you guys uh, can see me all right here. Um, as you can tell, I'm in the truck once again. Um, I'm posted up on another 34-hour reset, and uh, you know I got a lot of light that's um, coming in from uh, the windshield there. Uh, it's not the best place <laughs> for lighting, even if I turn on my uh, my bunk lights here. I don't know if that helps or it doesn't help, but we can leave that on for the time being. Um, I just want to come to you guys with uh, another video. Like I said, this one isn't going to be about, well, this one is going to be about uh, my TMC pay. And, you know, before I jump into it, I do want to uh, put a couple caveats out there. Um, a lot of people are going to be like, you know, they either like, the, the numbers I post or they don't like the numbers I post. Ultimately, it, it really doesn't matter. I'm trying to just put some information out there uh, for you guys so you have some kind of idea what you know TMC compensation looks like. Um, there are gonna be some drivers that you know make a lot more than I do. There's gonna be drivers that make a lot less than I do. I consider myself a little bit above average quote unquote, according to TMC standards, because TMC standards is about 65K um, yearly, right? For a rookie driver. And I'm making a little bit more than that. Um, I do not run like some of these guys out here. You know, every once in a while I'll run and uh, stay out for a week here, week there, you know, weekend here, weekend there, whatever you want to call it, and, and not go home. Like right now, I'm on a couple weekends out, right? And after this weekend, I'm going home. You know, I want to go see my family, but um, you know, TMC made it worthwhile for me to to be out these uh, you know past couple weeks, and I'll show those numbers. But you know, keep in mind that's not the norm for me. I, I really don't run um, like this. So when you see my numbers posted, really, it's going to only reflect uh, one week. Um, if you guys watched my previous video. Uh, where I did the TMC truck tour. Um, I was out running that week and I was at Brownsburg at the terminal and I, uh, you know, posted my, my first YouTube video um, in regards to the TMC truck tour. So I was actually out running. Uh, it was a very good week for me. Um, I'm not going to spoil the numbers. I'll, I'll wait and show you that once I get into, uh, you know, the numbers here shortly. Um, and this week is going to be very similar to, to last week, but like I said, keep in mind, these are not my normal uh, numbers that I run. Um, so, so there you have it. But also, I do want to say that despite these numbers that I'm posting, whether you like them, dislike them, or what have you, my biggest thing is about multiple streams of income. So I did briefly mention in my last video uh, that I, not, not just TMC, you know, out of this truck, you know, my downtime, I try to, you know, stay efficient and effective in terms of, you know, the amount of money that I can make and, you know, with my time. So in my downtime, I'm still generating income, you know, through multiple streams of income. Like I mentioned in my other video, I do uh, have other businesses that I do outside of being a company driver for TMC. Um, and I highly recommend that, you know, in regards to working you know, in the trucking industry, you know, if you're out here you're driving as a driver, whether you're an owner op, company driver, lease driver, what have you, you know, the saying goes, if you're, if your wheels ain't turning, you ain't earning and uh, ain't that the truth. Um, so it's always good to have multiple streams of income uh, that can help you out, uh, you know, to sustain, you know, the type of lifestyle that you want to live. So I'm going to jump into these numbers, right? We're going to go look at these and, you know, just to kind of, you know, put things out there and put things in perspective. You know, when you align yourself with TMC, they look at a 13 week average. So that's what we're going to look at. We're going to look at a 13 week average. I've been at TMC a little over seven months right now as a company driver. Um, so we're going to look at the 13 week average and I'm going to kind of play with those numbers a little bit because like I said, um, what I got posted up this week for pay is not my norm, so I don't want to kind of, you know, skew these numbers to where you're like, oh my God. But uh, I want to give you the best perspective and look at uh, what I'm making out here as a TMC driver. So without further ado, let's just kind of, you know, 
jump into these numbers and let's talk about it. I'll try to keep this video short and quick. Um, so let me go ahead and share my screen here. I am on Zoom. Uh, so let me go ahead and do that. Hopefully this is working out well. All right, so hopefully you guys can see my screen here. Uh, I won't know until after I do this video if this video is, is gonna be it's going to be good and I'm able to post this to YouTube, but um, let's go ahead and uh, take some look at some numbers. So these numbers over here in column A, these are my numbers that I want to be able to uh, play with on the spreadsheet. But as you could tell, um, there, there's 14 sets of numbers. That's all I could fit on my screen screenshot. Uh, and this screen right here is, is my pay. So it goes back 14 weeks. Uh, really, I'm just going to be looking at 13 weeks. So if you can look and see, today is May the 1st. Uh, what I got paid, uh, deposited yesterday from April 30th, 2021 is uh, 2580.78. Uh, so that's $2,500 and $2,580.78. And, $2, um, and it goes down to the last one, which is January. 29th where I got paid uh, fifteen hundred dollars fifteen eighty and uh, forty eight cents and you know we got all of these that are in between like I said there's 14 numbers that are posted here uh, but TMC goes by a 13 week uh, average as you can see over here uh, we see TMC driver stats you know my name you know outside of the lone wolf trucker is uh, Wayne Chappelle uh, I see my tractor number one two four four one and this is the last snapshot uh, from last week, uh, 425.21. Uh, shows my hire date when I got hired on. Uh, shows my tenure, seven months. Uh, weeks in this current certification period is three. We're in week three. And this is the 13-week rolling average, all right? Uh, right now, my rolling average, I don't know why this looks this low. Usually, I'm never 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 uh, below uh, 4200 revenue to the truck so i'm really not sure where this number is posting from but hey i'll take it with a grain of salt um and, and keep it moving from there uh this down here shows fleet manager rank my fleet manager is 28 out of 50. uh his boss my team leader is 160 out of 305. Uh, my division rank is 766 out of 1532 and uh, my fleet rank out of the whole fleet right so the fleet has 2361 drivers i'm 972 so as you can see by no means am i the top dog out here at tmc nor am i you know at the bottom of the totem pole um and down here uh shows you know my uh snapshot pay level is currently 31 percent now you know, granted, I fluctuate between 30 and 31. Uh, as a new rookie driver at TMC, you start off at 26% in most states. There are some states uh, that will start you off at 30%, but uh, for the most part, everyone starts off at 26% and works their way up uh, to a max of 34%. Um, highest I've been is 33%. You know, right now on the screen, you see right, right there, I'm 31% currently. And the lowest I've been, obviously, when I first started and my truck was at 26%. All right, so let's get into these numbers real quick, and then I'm going to end this video and keep it short and sweet. Um, so when we're looking at my numbers here, uh, like I said, you know, these past couple of weeks I've been running, I've been out, and, um, you know, what's reflected so far, what I got paid. Obviously, you don't get paid the same week that you're running. Uh, so what I got paid for last week, uh, you can see 43021 uh was $2580.78 uh for that week you know which is compensate me for being out and running but if you look here uh typically I don't run like that right I'm averaging anywhere from you know 1200 to $1600 um respectively uh in in my fluctuation of pay and as a driver you know you're not going to get the same paycheck week after week they're going to fluctuate like this so if you look at the lowest numbers here you know I, I had a real uh bad two weeks uh where i had a couple of breakdowns uh so that's why you see my numbers there are, are posted kind of low at 940 and four cents and 969 and 51 cents 
Um, I had an issue with my truck um, where the heat went out. Uh, you can see back in uh, February, um, I'm not sure which one of these uh, that week that fell on, but I did have a, a breakdown where I had no heat in the truck, no defrost, nothing, and uh, back in February, that was a problem. I uh, couldn't see out my windows, it was cold as shit, and uh, I had to get that fixed, so that cost me time and money having to go into the shop and get that fixed at, at Peterbilt. Uh, and then I had another breakdown. Um, I believe this was a tire. I had a tire blowout um, and had to wait had to wait a while to, to get that fixed. So that, that's falling on one of these. I can't remember which one it is, but both of these pay uh, periods um, where I got paid in the nines was because of a breakdown and I was either late uh, delivering my load and picking up the next one or I missed out on a load. I think both of these I missed out on a load. Uh, for that week, so I didn't get up to to my normal where I where I should be. Uh, it's about you know twelve fifty to you know sixteen it is my norm. Um, so when we look at these averages, right? So if I look at my true twenty my my true uh, thirteen week average, which would include uh, this week, this would be my last week off of the spreadsheet that I run, um, not off of TMC's uh, thirteen week average. But off of my 13 week average that I do personally, uh, you can see down on the bottom, uh, the sum for the 13 weeks is 18,530 and 69. Uh, average would be um, 1,425.44 uh, weekly uh, out of that 13 week average. But like I said, um, these two weeks that I'm running right here, um, one week is not posted. Actually, it'll be posted above this uh, once I get paid next week, which is going to be a similar uh, $2,500 uh, pay compensation. But let's look at what I normally would get paid, including, you know, these two uh, duds right here where I had two breakdowns back to back for that week. Uh, we go ahead and look at that because that's more of a true average of, of what I make as a TMC company driver uh, being a rookie here. This is my rookie year at TMC. So, the sum of the 13 weeks that I typically make is about 17,530 uh, and uh, 39 cents. And the average, you know, weekly is going to be around $1,348.49, right? And if you look at that, I did little calculations off the screen here. Um, my forecasted revenue for the year, just based off of this, and, and my last 13-week average is, is about the same. So right now, I finished two 13-week quarters, and uh, I'm in my third 13-week quarter, which is only going to be four quarters out of the year. So I'm just starting the, the third quarter. Um, but both of the two quarters that I've been at TMC are very similar uh, as far as compensation. Um, I did have uh, a couple other weeks where I ran, you know, 2,500 or better to the truck. But like I said, that's not something that I normally do. You know, if I get a wild hair up my ass and want to be out for a couple weeks and run, you know, that that's a compensation that I'm going to make is about 2,500 or better, um, you know, net to me. Uh, that's not even revenue to the truck. If you look at revenue to the truck making, um, you know, grossing or, or netting, however you want to look at it, um, you know, what you're going to get deposited uh, to your account before taxes and, and deductions, you know, that 2580.78, uh, um, when you look at that number and based off of, you know, what I'm, what I do, if, I, if I'm running a couple weeks here and there uh, to make that money, you know, that's going to be off of uh, revenue to the truck about uh, 7,000 to 7,500 bucks. So to the truck, but normally, I'm doing uh, 4,200 or better, you know, a uh, little bit more than that. Uh, but I'd say between 4,200 and 4,500 is the max. But my baseline that I need to make, that I make sure that my um, fleet manager understands is that I need, need minimum of $4,200 revenue to the truck, which would equate to, you know, about $1,200, $1,300, you know, and up. So that's why you see the numbers. Uh, where they are, and like I said, if if I miss that revenue, that 4,200 revenue to the truck, like I did here, um, then I'm not going to make, you know, what I should be making. Um, but you know, typically you're going to make about 1,250 
on average, as an average TMC driver, I'll post a, a link uh, down in the video to the TMC recruitment video, but they talk about it themselves. Uh, on average, you're going to make about $65,000 a year. Uh, obviously, there's people that make a lot more, people that make a lot less. On average, you're gonna make about 65K a year as a rookie driver, uh, which equates to about 1250, um, you know, gross to you before, you know, your taxes and deductions. Um, like I said, I'm making a little bit higher than that. My revenue, which is, is forecasted based off, I already have two quarters in the books, right? So I have two more quarters to go. But if I keep running the way I'm running, uh, I'm looking at about uh, 70,000, uh, you know, to 74,000. So right about 75, if you want to round it up or round it down, really doesn't matter. 74 to 75,000 uh, is what I'm forecasting on making. Uh, my goal may, you know, may be a little ambitious was to make about 85,000 my, my rookie year. And I could still do that. Um, but, you know, what I'm forecasting on my spreadsheet numbers is about 74 to 75,000. Which, like I said, I have other streams of, of income, so, you know, that, that fits into, into my playbook. Um, would it be nice to, to hit my goal of 85000 Sure it would, but, you know, that's going to come with sacrifice, as you can see. Um, you know, in order to post these numbers, um, if I was making twenty five eighty to the truck, you know, that's, that's a six-figure salary right there. Uh, from from TMC, but the beautiful thing about TMC, and you guys can knock it, hate it, like it, love it, or or what have you, is running off percentage versus mileage. Uh, so much better, in my opinion, because you have more control. and And when you look at this this thirty one percent right here, I mean that's all fine and dandy to me. That's icing on the cake. I could still make money at twenty six percent. Um, you know, I was making money, you know, when I first started at 26%. So 26, 31%, 33, where I, where I topped off at, um, I really don't focus on that too much. And that, and right now I'm at 31% because I like to run the truck. Right now my truck is off. You don't hear it running, but I run the truck and, and TMC kind of gets on me about that, about running the truck. Uh, but I like to be comfortable and I'm going to be comfortable. So if I need to run the truck and, you know, once I finish this video, I'm going to turn the truck back on because uh, it's a little hot out here right now. And uh, that's why I want to keep this video short. But um, there are my numbers for TMC. Uh, like I said, I'm, I'm running about uh, 74 right now for the year. Uh, when I look at my, my first 13 week averages, you know, coupled with uh, this 13 week average, I'm about 74. Uh, in, in regards to, to those numbers. So I'll probably leave it about there, like I said, but I just want to give you guys some kind of insight on what kind of money you can make uh, at TMC. Like I said, this is not the best numbers posted from a TMC driver and it's not the worst. So it's kind of middle of the, of the spectrum. So take it for what it's worth. You can like it, you can hate it. Uh, you guys can give me some, some shit about it. Really doesn't matter. Post your comments down below. I uh, welcome your feedback. Uh, and also, if you know uh, any companies out there, any local companies, I know I'm going to get some comments about, oh, man, you know, you should be going local or something like that. Uh, local's really not for me. I do enjoy over the road. But if you can find or if you know of any local companies paying rookie drivers in their first year uh, $2,500 a week, uh, please let me know. Please post that. Please post down below because I may, I may have to jump ship if uh, if I could find a local job uh, that's paying that kind of money to to a rookie driver. Um, but anyway, I digress. Um, hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video. Hopefully, it was informative uh, in regards to to my situation and my experience at TMC. Uh, with that being said, it's getting hot as hell in this truck, and uh, this is the Lone Wolf Trucker signing off. if I could figure out how to stop this video. Still trying to figure out how to stop the recording here. And I'm not editing it. I'm not gonna edit this video so you guys just see this on YouTube, but I found a button to turn this thing off. So 
Lone Wolf Trucker signing off.